when you're thinking about male female stuff. Oh, he's swimming. And he's fully like can't swim. So we've got Luna and Charlie here. They showed up five minutes ago. They're bored in trains. They need everything. They're nervous of dogs, they're nervous of people. They know sits and downs in the house. They have separation anxiety uh, from each other. They're nine months old. What does that mean, nine months old? They're going through the worst fear period. It's the hardest time to own a dog. There's two of them, so they have the sibling thing. They need everything. They did one private session the other day, about a month ago, scared of dogs, barking at dogs. So this is the first thing. They, they have met Prince a month ago. We're gonna, they just met him two seconds ago through this fence. So now we're gonna let Prince in. We're gonna watch what happens. What do you think the most important thing for dogs like this? Nervous of people, nervous of dogs, untrained. The most important thing is them for the live life and have experiences. Your dogs, live life, have experiences. A lot of walks, a lot of meaning of dogs, safely. A lot of meaning of people, children tossing them treats. It's not about sits and downs and stays. Forget all that, that's good and we're gonna do that. The main thing is living life. Uh, going places, seeing things, desensitizing. If you can get your nine month old dog who's nervous through that fear period, you're gonna come out on the other side at a year and go, wow, my, I have a confident dog. You actually have to like go m more and more hardcore in that nine months. Well, not making them scared, but you gotta be like, we're doing this during that fear period and then they come out of it like really good. Cause this, their, their nervousness is not a fear period thing. It's partly but they're actually nervous. Ready? Prince coming in. Prince! Prince! Go see your friend. The girl, Luna, is a little more nervous than the boy, Charlie. The boy's the bigger one. They're brother and sister. Someone might fall in the water right here, which would be kind of exciting. Right, they're just, they're, they're, they're a little nervous. They're unsocialized. She's, that's kind of a scared run. You guys ask for a lot of body language stuff, okay? Here it is, you see her run when he was pursuing? Her ears pinned, here, watch this right here. He looks better than her, actually. I said he's a little more nervous, he's not. I flipped it, I forgot. When they came at a session, he got comfortable quicker. That is sometimes the male-female dynamic. The females in Dobermans especially <clears throat> can be a little more high strung. They can be a little more protective. That's something to think about when you're thinking about male-female stuff. Oh, he's swimming. And he's fully like, can't swim. Come on, buddy, come on, you did it, you did it. You did it! And we always cheer when the dogs swim. You go, yay! <laughs> I did not see that. I hope you got that on camera because that was pretty wacky. He just like went in and almost went down. They can all swim. We get a lot of dogs in the water. Most of them can swim. I love when dogs get wet, especially when it's warm. It's not that warm. They feel better. It just gives them a good feeling. Then they play harder, okay? So that is, I'm gonna do a lot of video. You guys have asked for puppy stuff. Now, nine months, is that a puppy? Mm, not really. Four months is a puppy. But there's not, you guys are also asked for nine month old stuff. That's what we're gonna do. I'm gonna do a lot of videos with these guys. They don't know anything. So you wanna learn the process of training dogs like this? You guys have these dogs. Nine month old fearful dogs, COVID dogs. And you're going through a fear period. This is big. I'll try to do a bunch of videos showing you the progress of these guys. This was the first introduction. You got to see the first time they met a dog. They met him a month ago. So it wasn't perfect first time, but we'll show you the progress of these guys, all right? That's the dogs. what did you learn in this video? You learned that, a little bit about the baseline of these guys, right? The nervousness from her, some body language from her. You saw this guy just fall in the water basically. So that's that, that's it.